search continues today for 82-year-old Roberta Martin. Police are calling the disappearance of the Innisburg woman suspicious. Police were in the area all day again today, and so was our Ike Ben David, who joins us live now. Ike, what's the latest in this? No significant updates, according to police, in the case of the missing 82-year-old, which leaves much more, many more questions than we have answers this evening. This police, uh, the crime scene search team and all these police cars that have been here all day as the investigation continues. This was the scene in Enosburg on Friday, just a few feet down from the road from Roberta Martin's residence, an active crime scene as police took photos of her neighbor's home. They're just doing their job. On Thursday, neighbors told Channel 3 they were told to leave due to a search warrant, pointing to duct tape left in their yard. But it's not clear if anything police collected is evidence. Down the road, police parked on Vince Zeccanelli's property to search through tall grass in the nearby woods. He said he was happy to let police use his property in their search for the missing woman, evidence, or any suspects. Uh, whatever it takes to uh, find either Roberta or whoever did whatever to her. Did you see anything on your property? Anything odd? No. Zeccanelli says Martin was a kind neighbor. He's still in shock about her suspicious disappearance. Mm. Couldn't believe it. Um, it's terrible, terrible tragedy. Uh, I hope they find her, um, but it's been a few days now and makes us all a little worried whether it'll have a positive outcome or not. Martin's house now sits empty, surrounded by crime scene tape as friends and family are left to pray she's found safe. Still not clear what led up to the 82 year old woman to, to go missing. But again, according to police, as of this evening, there are still no significant updates in this investigation. Reporting live in Enosburg, Ike Ben David, Channel 3 News.